Hi uh, and welcome back to the vlog. My name is Loazi. If you're new here, thank you for joining me. Please subscribe and hit the like button. And yeah, so today is actually a mini travel vlog, a day vlog. I am actually going to Nanjing, which is like a city an hour away from us because my MacBook screen got broken. I don't know how I messed it up. But yeah, I'm going to Nanjing Apple Store there because my dead ass city doesn't have a, an Apple Store. Hopefully it doesn't cost me an arm and a leg because honestly it's screwing up my travel plans. I had already budgeted for like a lot of things during this winter holiday. Oh, I didn't tell you guys. So we are actually on, I think I'll tell you guys later. Yeah, okay, I need to go. My, my taxi is here. Wait, anyhow. Oh, Mashang, Mashang, So I am in Nanjing. I just went to the this this uh, hotel over here, but I don't think this is a place I want to go to. I actually, want to go to an actual Apple store, uh, a repair store inside there. But that's the place I booked for. I'm not sure if I trust it, so I'm just gonna go to the Apple store just now and see if I can be able to fix it there, or maybe they'll send me back here. I don't know. I'm not sure. But everything looked legit. I'm just afraid of taking my laptop to a place where it's not really legit. But when I booked online yesterday, it was this place. So maybe I'll come back here again. I'll see. I was so anxious along the way because when you're traveling here in China, Ni hao. When you're traveling here in China during the pandemic, obviously it's still the pandemic, there's cases everywhere. So like a city can just change in like a matter of a day from like medium risk to high risk or whatever. And if that happens, that means you have to go on quarantine. So they're very, very strict with their rules here. So I'm just like really anxious about like coming here, fixing my laptop and going back home without being any, without having any cases because then that means I'll have to quarantine or something. Honestly, that's one of the reasons that deterred me from traveling because you just never know. And I don't really want to go to quarantine because last year was really, really rough. So, yeah, I'm just like, you're just anxious every time you travel. Hopefully I get my laptop fixed uh, in like a day. I'll ask them though if they can just like ship it back to me after they fix it so I don't have to come back to the city. And I'm not really, really sure when this vlog is going to come out because now I don't have a laptop to edit. <laughs> Oh, here's the mall. So nice being in a big city. I have arrived at Apple. So I'm just waiting for my appointment. It's in 20 minutes, I think. It's just 11.15. 11.51. So they're going to come and fix my laptop just yet. I'm not supposed to actually not be wearing my face mask, but I want to speak to you guys. Oh, there's iPhones here. Let me show you. They look so nice. 13, iPhone 12. Everything is so expensive. Like, But I just need to know how much phones are because I might have to get a new phone pretty soon. So, yeah. I don't know if I showed you. I showed you guys my laptop. The screen is broken. I nicked it with my charger. Let me turn it on so you can see. So half of the screen over here is just nicked and then this is where it's back like the actual over here. So basically I'm screwed. I don't know how much this is gonna cost. Okay, let's go and get some coffee while I wait for my appointment. Apparently it's gonna be really expensive and the man is actually like the engineer is trying to tell me how much it's gonna cost. All of my travel plans are out the window now. Honestly I just hope I can afford it and it's not as much as like getting a new laptop. Uh, okay. Uh, Indian Tax Oh, check. Okay. It's so expensive, but it's it's not like getting a new laptop. Let me show you how much it will cost. Okay, guys. Four thousand three hundred and twenty-four RMB. That's about how much in rent? I'm not sure how much is that in rent. Let me find out. That's like 10,000. It's okay, it's still way cheaper than how much I paid for it. Can I do, do 
三天，三天是 three days， 哦 three days。那你们可以那个就是那个送出那个我的信息，那我就在彩彩州，我就在那边。嗯，不行，不行，对，必须要自己过来拿。对对对对。啊。So they can't ship it back to me. I have to physically come back here in three days and get it collected. But at least today is Saturday, so if it's from. From what time will it start? Today or tomorrow? Three days. Tomorrow. Ah, February. Ah, February. Seventeenth. Oh, that's good. So I'll get it on the seventeenth, which is sixteenth. Seventeenth. Ah, that's like man. Seventeenth. Oh, uh, when we finish the last repair, we will call you. Oh, okay, okay. So even if it's three days, it's still very fast. So that means I'll be able to edit this vlog because I'm really on a roll this year. Like I really want to like try and like be consistent and post like videos every Friday for a year and see how that's gonna work. You know, I really want to dedicate my my time to you. Okay, so he's busy doing everything, and then I'll see you guys later. Tuesday, I'm not sure. They'll send me an email when it's ready. Now I need to go and have breakfast because I haven't eaten anything today. But I am done in the city for today. Uh, yeah, just gonna walk around the mall and see if I can like spend more of my money. <laughs> oh well. I mean, I, obviously I had lots of anxiety about traveling because like after quarantine. But yeah, I think I'm just gonna stay in my city. It's okay, and I also needed to save, honestly, because I've been backtracked because of quarantine. Like, I didn't get paid in most of my salary for November, and then so it's like... One thing about me is that I want to stick to my financial goals and my financial plan, so... Yeah, even if I'm, like, let down by this, but I'm still okay because my financial plans are still on track. I am at Uniqlo now. I'm just here to see if they have nice stuff. For winter... Main section, where is the main section? Oh, there it is. charge my phone too. Hungry. Just gonna take a shower and then I will see you guys tomorrow. So exhausted today. I came back so late yesterday and I was like I'm just gonna stop vlogging because I was really exhausted. And then when like around 8 p.m. when I was about to go to bed, 
I got an email saying that my MacBook has been fixed and it's ready for collection. And now I have to go travel back to the city to like get collect it. I mean, if they told me it'd take like a few hours, I could have spent the night in the city. My lips are so dry. I could have spent like a night in the city in a hotel and then like picked it up and then came back today. But today I'm not really going early. I'm leaving at 10. And now it's currently 9.12. It's like, I'm going to eat leftover pizza. I've got my coffee. I'm just trying to find my journal. Just want to journal a little bit and then, yeah. I might also just like go to a park. I went, yesterday I, I roamed around a little bit. I went to like, I went to the window shop and stuff. I didn't buy anything because I'm trying to save my coins. But I walked around the city and then like shops. But I think I need to find like a, a park because I want to brainstorm ideas and stuff. And just like before I come back. So I think I'll see you guys when, when we get there. I am at the Apple store again in Nanjing. I'm here to pick up my laptop. I think I'm just gonna invest in getting a new screen protector because honestly, I spent way too much money on this. Oh, hi. Oh. My MacBook is back. It looks brand new. It looks almost like brand new. They even cleaned it. Uh -huh. yeah. The content inside, you didn't clean up. We know that you want to keep your data. Oh, thank you so much. Because I did back it up, but like I didn't have enough space, so I didn't back up everything. Uh, we may have a chance, but uh, normally we will not erase your data. Oh, okay, perfect. Oh. And you will get the 19 days warranty, warranty. Uh, for the display. Oh, okay. So I can pay using uh, Alipay, right? Yes, yes. 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 Please sign here and to confirm we've done all the repair. Okay. Uh, do you need the receipt or invoice? Uh, you can send me via email. Yes. Brand new laptop. So is this your first time coming to our store? Yes. Yeah. I, I, I live in Taizhou. So we don't have an Apple store in Taiju. Yeah, okay. you drive here or take the... I took Hello Bike. Do you know Hello Bike? Hello, Hello Bike? Yes, I use Hello Bike. How long it takes? Uh, one hour, 30 minutes. And it costs 4,300. So I thought I would have to like reboot everything because I didn't have enough storage space in my hard drive but luckily they just they didn't flash out everything my data in my laptop so I basically still have everything according as how it was before. Now I'm just gonna roam around the city and see what else I'm gonna do but I am done. I'm gonna go get a thumbnail now. Though. I'm so happy they fixed it in like a, in like a day because I have like a meeting I have like a call tomorrow and it's, on a, it's a zoom call it's a very important call and I didn't know how I was gonna use my phone because I need to have something on the side to like refer to notes and stuff for my talking points so now at least I have my laptop and my phone so I can be on the call and just use my phone for like referencing and stuff yes I'm done okay. this came from my laptop yeah, I just want to need your hair yeah no I okay. can help yes Thank you, bye bye. Can I draw this? Where can I draw this? No need. Uh, thank you. So I'm just gonna chill over here, get a cup of coffee, and just brainstorm a few ideas and journal a little bit. Oh, and before I do anything, I need to get like a new screen protector for my MacBook because otherwise I'll be screwed again. So, so I don't have to get inconvenienced again with the same thing because this is way too much. I'm not really sure if I'm gonna go to the park because I'm gonna run out of time because it's almost three o'clock now and I still haven't had brunch or done anything else. You know? I think I'm just gonna roam around the mall and just go back, just looking at cameras. 
This is a really nice Canon camera. So expensive. Sony cameras are really expensive. But someday, someday I'll get a Sony camera. Far off places, my love she sits. My love is waiting to set me free. Do you believe the realest things don't take up spaces? So hard to find. I'm watching Lydia Dinger's uh, engagement story video. I'm so, so happy for her. And I'm also eating my leftovers from Blue Frog. So happy that my laptop is back. Uh, we'll see you guys tomorrow. Good morning. So today I feel really exhausted. Like, I think it's just like going back and forth two days to Nanjing. Kind of exhausted me. But yeah, so today I'm just going to take it easy. I need to clean my place though. It's very dirty. I haven't cleaned it. And I also haven't taken out, I haven't like took out the Christmas tree. It's still here. I just ordered some croissants and bread from the bakery. So I'm going to make breakfast uh, croissants and then some coffee. I'm busy watching some Jolie on YouTube and yeah. <laughs> it as how it is and just shove it into the closet and then next year I'll just whip it out showering my place is all cleaned and my barber came to get me a haircut mom making i don't know if this is brunch or whatever eggs and breakfast sausages and toast i think so the call that i was supposed to have today at 5 p.m i got an email yesterday telling me that it's cancelled and yeah so i don't know i was kind of looking forward to it but sometimes when things are not for you they're really not for you and I found it strange yesterday when, they, when I got the email saying that it's cancelled because it was on a Sunday. I was like, who's working on a Sunday? And then I realized that certain companies are actually working over the weekend because they're trying to make up the days before they go on the Chinese, go on Chinese, go for the holidays for the Chinese New Year. So, yeah. I don't know if I mentioned this in this vlog, but like we are officially on holiday for like a whole month. I'm on winter vacation slash spring festival break. This is my Christmas gift that I actually... Well, I did open it, but I forgot about it for like a few few weeks, actually. So I've got the scented candle. Yeah. It smells really nice. Oh, and then we also did like Polaroids during Christmas. So I've got like photos of myself for Christmas. And then another one. Yeah. The 
this is what's inside there is i think this is for tea i'm not sure yeah these are just like a cinnamon sticks some lemon and some flowers oh there's honey what is this i don't know what this is let's open it and see mm, not be sure what this is There's crystals or whatever. I don't know what this is. I think it's tea. I'm not sure. There's also like a... This is a frag, Fraggy Panny and Gardenia. Okay, it's a moisturizing soap. And there's also a nice small little Q-cup. There's also some stuff inside here. There's flowers, golden spoon. What is this? Delicate aroma, mineral wax, and pure essential oil. Oh, it's scented candles again. It's another scented candle. Another scented candle. Mm, smells really nice. I like everything. Like two scents of candles, some honey, some tea, some stuff for tea. These are my Polaroid cap. Some salt. I don't know what this is for. I think I'm just learning just to be okay with like making vlogs. And sometimes I just like uneventful and mundane. But yeah. I think I'm also just learning to be okay with making, uh, just like showing you, showing you my everyday life, even if it's not as interesting as I want it to be. But I guess, yeah, this is it for today. Just ordered some groceries online. Got like some kitchen towels. Packets of banana. Huge as pineapple. Uh, some blueberries. Some blueberries. Oh. I also got some bleach. My white sheets are not really white, so I'm gonna soak them into bleach and make them look super white. I've got some chili pep uh, powdered pepper. Some clothes softener. I got some flour because I want to make um, steamed bread. I'm very, I'm feeling very, I'm actually very homesick today. And then I got some scraps. I'm feeling very, I'm feeling very homesick. I'm very fra fragile. These, so I'm just gonna make like uh, beans, stewed beans, and then I'm gonna make uh, steamed bread. I'm just gonna have that. I used to have this meal every time when I was growing up. So this is probably the only thing I hate about my apartment is that like I don't really have a barrier here or like a sliding door with windows so my laundry is just like everywhere. So yeah I've been doing laundry the whole day today. I've just been indoors and another thing is like my AC has been on literally the whole day. So I'm afraid for my bill this month for electricity it's gonna be a lot. Also making my steamed bread. It's currently in the rice cooker at the moment. So excited. My mom would be proud of me. I think I'm just gonna take it easy tonight and I'm really exhausted, but I'm gonna stop saying that. But yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow. If I don't see you tomorrow, this is the end of today's vlog. And yeah, thank you for watching and please do subscribe and I will see you in the next one. Goodbye.